Hey everybody, this is Pastor Robinson from Harvest Church of Hampton, and I'm bringing you another thought of the week. We're continuing on our theme about quotes this week. So let me read you this quote that actually comes from a soldier's journal from the midst of the battle in World War II, okay? No man is a leader until his appointment is ratified in the minds and hearts of his men. No man is a leader until his appointment is ratified in the minds and hearts of his men. Did you hear that? What this brought to my mind was that no man is even worthy to be called a leader until the people designate him as one. It made me think about uh, King David. Before David even became king, he was serving under King Saul. But David went out to battle one time against the Philistines. And when he came back home, the entire city had come out to meet him. Men and women cheering his name. And then the women were over on the side, singing and dancing and praising, saying, Saul has slain his thousands and David has slain ten thousands. Wow. Now that is evidence of being ratified in the eyes of the people. If you're a leader out there today, I want to encourage you. You don't have to do something to make people follow you. The people will confirm that you're the leader. I want you to have a great day. Go out and be blessed. Amen.